Hello world, I'm Josh. I'm Lauren. And in this video we are reviewing Steve's Ice Cream's Burnt Sugar Vanilla. Straying away from the couch on this one because we already had the camera set up from before with the gin. This is number 47, like I said, Burnt Sugar Vanilla. You can learn about it at stevesicecream.com, Twitter, at Steve's Ice Cream. It says vanilla that is slightly bittersweet, caramelized, burnt sugar, folded into dairy-free organic vanilla coconut cream made with Medicat, Medcas, M-A-D-E... Yeah, Medicas. C-A-S-S-E-E, -E, the E has an accent on it, on the second, the first E, Medicas. Fair trade vanilla imported from Madagascar. A perfect frozen rendition of creme brulee. So basically, you've got a coconut cream ice cream. Coconut ice cream brulee. Creme brulee. <laughs> coconut ice cream creme brulee. Something like that. Alright, what do you think, Lauren? Bubba? I really like it. It's very tasty. This is interesting when I. Stuck my spoon in it, like oozed out that burnt sugar. Yeah. I just didn't expect that. Burnt sugar pieces don't really do much, but it's a nice touch. It's you can definitely taste with this. I think more than some of their other flavors that it's coconut, not dairy. It tastes You're right. a little bit fruitier I almost want to say or sweeter version like a fruitier or sweeter version of vanilla but it's still quite good I love the consistency as always it is just a little bit easier to keep solid than dairy ice cream it um yeah it has a great texture and I really like the taste how about you I agree um, it's good. It has like an interesting like snowy almost consistency. Um, it does, the coconut cream really does come through in the flavor. It tastes a lot like vanilla coconut. I mean, even when I obviously get a, uh, little burnt sugar pocket in there. It doesn't. It doesn't come out at me. Yeah, very it doesn't much. translate. So we've had this experience with some other steves before, like their um, bourbon vanilla tastes is sort of like banana, like bananas, if I remember it's right. It's that sweeter than vanilla taste. It's that fruit sweetness. I don't necessarily get a fruitiness, but I get coconut and vanilla, and like. Mm-hmm. I had to really search for the burnt sugar. I I like it better for some reason in this one than the other one. I think maybe because I'm used to it. I think Steve's makes fan freaking fantastic ice cream, but occasionally has a naming issue, to be honest. This one, it makes sense with the pieces of burnt sugar, but it, the pieces don't quite come to the forefront. I'm not saying they didn't try. Yeah. That doesn't make sense. It, if it was called coconut vanilla, I'd be like, yeah. Perfect. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, it's not like, ob if you, I guess what I'm saying is, if you gave it to me blindfolded, I would say that tastes like vanilla and coconut. Yeah. And totally. then I'd be like, there is a sort of occasional grittiness of sweetness in there. But I'd have never been able to say, that's burnt sugar. Yeah. I would never have guessed. And I certainly holding. never would have said that tastes like a creme brulee. Yeah. But it's a really nice coconutty version of vanilla. Really good ice cream. Yeah. I really like it. It's I fabulous. It, I mean, I really love the texture in particular. If I ignore the name, it's probably like a seven and seven and a half. It's got the softness, but it doesn't melt as much. It's great. Yeah, I'd give it a seven. 
Yeah, in my opinion, it's like a seven of an ice cream, but it's sort of like a four of a burnt sugar vanilla. Yeah, it does not fit the description very accurately, but I, in general, really like it. I love it. I eat it all the time, but does not scream burnt sugar vanilla. It screams coconut vanilla. I think it would make more sense if the pieces of sugar were actually hard. Or if there was just more of it. Yeah, but since they're kind of just soft and mushy, it, it mushes into the ice cream. Disappears. I think we've covered it. Alright, uh, let us know what we should review next. We have a few in store already, but let us know. Leave a comment. Uh, subscribe if you like what we're doing, and we'll see you next time. Bye.